no winged harpies were harmed or sent to a oh god I can't say that word F fury fiery grave during the production of this motion picture <laughs> always <laughs> goodness well this was episode uh, 16 and I thought it was a very very good episode um, I didn't expect to see Marcus again uh, but I'm glad he returned and I liked I actually liked him way more in this episode and I'm so happy that we could uh, see you know see his, see him even grow wait see him grow even more and I realized that at one point it seemed like he didn't really learn a lesson or was being tempted because it was a very big temptation and even though it was annoyed at that moment it's very understandable that he'll be um, tempted to, to keep the helmet so he uh, you know, could be, I mean, so he did have to have, like, live in eternity, you know, being tortured. So that's very understandable, but I'm glad that in that moment, he realized himself, like, wait a minute, this is what you were telling me, like, it is about what I want, it's about what's right. That was a very good moment, uh, and there were a lot of great scenes, and I also think the acting, again, was very good, um, Lucy is good in every single episode. She's always, always killing it. Um, but I think the actor who plays Marcus also did a very good job. Um, I actually cared about him, and I, and I also cared about their bond, about their connection, about their relationship. And I think they had great chemistry. Um, yeah, I really, I really enjoyed this episode. There were, there were uh, some action moments, but especially because of the emotion in this episode. They got to me as well, uh, and I'm very happy uh, that we got uh, this sort of happy but also bitter ending that even though he can be with the Legion fields, that, um, you know, he's still not alive. You know, they can't really be together at the same time they're still together. As it's seen, I said, he's still in our heart and he always will be in our heart. And I really like that, um, that he said that whenever someone of the living thinks about them, that they can... Uh, feel it. They know that they're thinking about them. That was also very beautiful. Um, Gabrielle, she didn't have a, a very big role this episode, but I was really proud of her with that fight scene. She almost uh, defeated him. Um, at the end, he knocked her out, but still, she did a, a very good job. Uh, and it was a very tense scene. And I really thought for a second he ate something of her. I'm glad that she was alright. But that scene I screamed though, when she thought that Gabriel was, you know, in a, in bigger trouble. Woo! That was a real deal. Um, in Hades, I think when we first saw him, I was a little bit unimpressed. I was like, wait, he's he Hades? I'm still bad at the process name. But I kind of, uh, I'm not sure if like is the right word, but I guess I liked him more than when I, we first see, uh, seen him. Uh, he's alright, and, um, I'm glad that he, with the, with the new judgment he gave, uh, he, um, did, he didn't do Marcus dirty, you know, he, he heard what Sina said, he, he, he realized it himself, and she also told him, like, you've seen it, you've seen what is in his heart, uh, so I'm glad that Hades didn't do some kind of dick move, but, you know, brought it to the good side, um, so yeah. I, don't know, I can't really got got in my thoughts well, I'm sorry. But this is, I don't know, I just really enjoyed this episode. It's definitely one of my favorites. Uh, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. Bye.